Hey, what's happening, YouTube? It's Dan Kusunev here. So, um, today I just finished watching High School DxC Season 3, and, well, I gotta say, I love it still. I still love it. I still love High School DxC, no matter what. Um, I kind of wish the intro was a little bit earlier than May 1st, but you know what, but you know, what can you do about it? Um, I think, well, it's, uh, um, the Grabbing Dragon song, <laughs> um, I heard it in English in the, if, I heard it in English in the um, see, the season, the series, the season finale of High School DxD season three, and I gotta say it's a little weird. And I gotta say it's still a weird song, no matter what. It's weird in English. It's weird in Japanese. It's just weird. But what can you do? I mean, Easy's a freaking pervert, and he'll do anything to keep. It'll do, any, it'll do anything to grab to grab to grab some titties, or su or su or suck on some nips, or get his pole grease, basically. Um, what do they think of Ross Feist becoming a devil? What's the guy? Huh. Sorry guys, uh, I had to do that. I didn't have to. I mean, I wanted to. That's why I did it. But, um. So, yeah, the season was good. Um. I find it a little weird that Loki. I find it a little weird that Loki put a curse on. Rius and Issei. When, in fact, it wasn't Rius who defeated him. When it wasn't Rius and Issei who defeated him. It was really just Issei who defeated him. So I don't know why he would put a curse on, on Rius. When he should just put the curse on Issei. But no, he had to go for the full... No, we had to go all the way in because <sighs> but no, we had to go all the way and curse both Reese and Issei. Which I just think is. Which, again, to me, it's just really, really weird that he did that. Um. I really do find it weird that um what do they have Ross Vice? 
I mean, she's pretty cute. That's about it. That's all I think. Like, so is that she's pretty cute. Um. So, yeah, um, my thoughts on Odin. Um, well, I mean, he's a different version of Odin than the one you suit. I mean, he's definitely not the MCU version of Odin. That's for sure. Which I'm okay with. And of course, Sorry guys, um, thoughts on Loki are, well, he's a dick, like always, pretty much how he's been in the MCU, um, I thought on season three as a whole, it's, well, it's okay. I mean, I kind of wish he did it. I kind of wish. I kind of wish that at the end of season three, um, my hopes for season three, my hopes 
do I think it could have been better a little bit? Yeah, I do. Definitely. Um, could some of the lines have been changed? Oh, definitely. Definitely. Well, not the lines, but could have been changed? Definitely. Here's another thing it should have let. Here's how I think how here's how I think season three sh here's how I think the final battle in season three should have went. Issei is saving Rius. Re Issei Rius going landing on a beach. Issei saying aloud to Rius, "I love you." Um, then they base, then they go, then they go through some more, then they go through a war pole where they've been, where they start dating, on that beach, that's when they start dating. And then they come back to the present, to the present future. And they come back to the present where nothing's changed except for the fact that those who are one thing one thing will, will, will change. That'd be Issei and Reese's relationship. <clears throat> And Issei's dream. Which would be... Which would be... Not being Harem King. Because I don't think he... Because personally, I don't think he should be a Harem King. I think he should just be a loving husband. I think he should just be a loving boyfriend, husband to Rius. So, yeah, um, well, so, my thoughts, so, and then when she, when they came back, they just started dating. Reese and Issei. Then, or actually, they just finished their like their first date on a beach. And then, Sir Zex, Sir Zex, and then Sir Zex, and of course, Reese's dad would come, would bring them down, bring Issei and Reese down. To congratulate Issei on, on bringing back Rius, and then Grafia and Rius's mother go off and have some fun. Like, like, like have a girls there with Akino, Azia, Zenovia, Konako, Idina, Ross Faisa, uh, Jazz. Whereas then Issei would then ask Sir Zax and Reese's father for her hand in marriage. Now that they, now that I suggest they get married while they're still in high school. I feel like they should get married like when they're out of high school and maybe when Issei's in college. Because I really think that Issei loves Reese enough to not become harem king, which if she does, which if she does, that'd be awesome. Because I mean, again. Because again, I ha because again, I made a theory video of why he, again, I, again, I made a video of why these two should become a couple, and all points to <clears throat> episode three.
or four or five of season one. Where they where those who were those who were going to get married. So, yeah, um, those are my thoughts on season three. Now, for my thoughts on the whole series, on the series of the season three. Um, Um, do I think the series could have been handled a little bit better? No. I think the series was handled perfectly the way it was supposed to be. Um, do I... My thoughts on the characters? I love DSA. I love Rius. Um, Kiva is okay. I love his sword birth ability. I wish this was almost like High School DxD World 4. I wish this was, I wish this world was like the High School DxD World. Wherever everybody was a different, wherever you, wherever was a character in, in the show. So yeah, is it a good series? Yeah, I definitely think so. I definitely think that's a good series for sure. So yeah. Um my thoughts on Koniko liking re liking Issei at the and the series was kinda weird I think. But yeah. But I mean but I mean overall it's a good series. I strongly recommend now I strongly do not recommend this series for kids. I mean, if you're looking for a good anime that's, I mean, if you're looking for an anime series that's good for kids, then I try My Hero Academia, uh, Yu Gi Oh GX, Yu Gi Oh Brains, Yu Gi Oh Five Ds, Yu Gi Oh, Yu Gi Oh Zexel, uh, anything that's real, anything that's fun for kids, I would recommend those. Except for for the X Six, it's more for. Adults slash teenagers. So everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on notifications to be notified of future videos. And as always, thank you for your time. Stay tuned. Saying out. Peace.